close crew. Luke, massively disappointing because bags of effort, but you just couldn't break them down. Yeah, it was a very pleasing first half for all the boys, especially um, how many chances we created, how many shots on goal we had. I was guilty of missing a few few uh, shots on target, but uh, at the end of the day, we come in, come in at half-time thinking very positive and it was, the goal was coming sooner rather than later, but it didn't work didn't work out like that but like I say pleasing first half not so much second half yeah, you had quite a few efforts on goal why was that I don't know I was just getting myself uh, getting myself forward trying to get in <laughs> get in the action I was guilty of a few missing a few uh, off target I had one of them keep made a great save but uh, I was guilty of missing a few uh, chances but we still had <coughs> we still had enough chances first half and even bits and pieces second half to get us a, get us a goal and get us the win but it didn't work out like, work out like that but we've got to stay positive still yeah, strange game that so many chances were from around about the 20, 25 yard mark and yet very few chances in the box yeah exactly it was one of those games that were, they've come and, and done their game plan very well if they've come away with a win haven't they so but for us it was little, we had to be a little bit more patient than, than some games that we have been but uh, it was just one of those games I think where you've got to look at it and say we've got to sweep that under the carpet now and look back uh, at the more positive notes from the game and look forward to Saturday and getting back on that winning run and getting three points at home and you mentioned Saturday, it's Plymouth, so a game that presumably you'll look forward to more than most? Uh, not so much. Every, for me, every game this season is is the same as each one. Plymouth is Plymouth games, Plymouth games for me, to be honest. It's not a, a bigger one as today. Today was the, the bigger one carrying on the run, but I'm looking forward to Saturday and hopefully get back on the winning run and, and get us back uh, to three points, especially at home. Yeah, I suppose it is vital that you get back on the bike, isn't it? Yeah, definitely, especially the way we've we've uh, played over the last month or so. We've had great results, we've played well. The last two we haven't played as well as we can do, but we've still got to stay positive and just remember we're going to stay positive, work Thursday, Friday and hopefully come Saturday at three o'clock we'll be raring to go and get in uh, three points. That's fine for me, thank you Luke. Luke, you, you de- determined to treat Saturday as any other game because yeah, it, it might affect your game otherwise? Yeah, no, I'm, like I say, it's every game this season is is the same as the last game and the next game forward I've got to stay focused I'm not bothered who who, who would, could be against crew again Saturday for all I care so for me it's just another game where I hopefully I'll be able to play again and get another 90 minutes and hopefully score the most important thing if we come away 5 o'clock on Saturday with 3 points we'll be we'll be over the moon Yeah. What, what sort of view did you have of the penalty decision tonight do you think it was a penalty? Uh, from where I was you could hardly tell but at the end of the day the rest give it so we can't look back on it in any any grievances so at the end of the day we've got to take take that we've got to walk away now and assess what what happened here second half not so much first half because I thought first half we played positively created enough chances but uh, got on the training ground Thursday and stay positive and look ahead for Saturday do you think when you're playing here just getting an early goal or, or the first goal is, is the key uh, I think so yeah not I think so in, in many aspects of the game especially with the way teams have come here and especially the run we've been on them they've been uh, more shutting up shop against us so we've got to be very very much patient with our game if we don't win it the first 10 minutes we don't win it you know what I mean we've got to, we've got to play till the 90th minute if, we, if we're still not in you know, the 90th minute we've still got to play the same way as we will in the first half and stay positive create chances and hopefully take them yeah have you been on any runs like this in your career where you've been you know set back for one game and then got straight back on it and got uh, another good run I can't really recall any but this is I've been enjoying it so much recently I've just been focusing on the run we've been on and hopefully carrying it out Unlucky for us, it's it's not happened for us tonight. But hopefully we can carry, get back on that winning run because uh, we've been in good form recently. Yeah. Do so you feel like you had a decent game yourself? I know you'd like to have scored, but in uh, all yeah, played, you think it, at the end of the day you've got to look at it. it was we lost we lost one nil at home, so can't really take as, as much bearing of my set personal game. I was happy to where I played first half, maybe not so much second half, but uh, very. I'm more pleased that I'm getting the games and enjoying my football still. But I was a bit disappointed after the game, looking the way we've the way we've lost one nil. Could have created, could have uh, scored one of my chances, but at the end of the day, that's been and gone now. I've got to keep my head up and hopefully want to go in again soon. Yeah.